What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Gerald from Bank of Gerald here with another video update. Today is Monday, April the 24th, 2023. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here to talk about Biddy Look. There have been some changes, as we all know, and we're just staying as updated as possible on what's going on. Um, today is Monday. Um, this is, was the tentative date that they said they would start having some things moving in a, a better direction. And we're going to test out a few things while we're here on video. Before we get started, I want to remind all of you that I am not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice, and I am not your financial advisor, right? I'm just a dude on YouTube showing you guys how I'm cranking out that crypto in many different platforms. Nothing more and nothing less than that. Now, if you like this content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. If you want to be updated and notified about everything going on here at BOJ, make sure you get the notification bell as well. And please, sir, please, ma'am, don't get scammed by the WhatsApp man because if the WhatsApp man gets you or the helpline or wherever in the comment section that you think is me, that ain't me, there's nothing I can do to help you. All right. So stay diligent in this space. The first thing that I want to go ahead and do is I want to go ahead and look at the note in the back office of Video Look. All right. It says right here, this was a note actually today. It looks like 531 a.m. I mean, it says corporate executives and community leaders are working very hard to bring the utmost favorable outcome for the entire community. Our objective is to first assure that everyone is made whole. As you know, Sam Lee has acquired Viddy Look and absorbed the liability. That act alone will ensure the first objective is met. The next objective is to restructure the Viddy Look platform so it will have the proper reward system that we all can be proud of. However, most importantly, we aim to build in the mechanisms to ensure growth and longevity. We are discussing plans and ideas to implement all of these wonderful outcomes. With regards to reinstating the disabled accounts, that switch will be flipped on in the next 12 to 24 hours. In that moment is when the 14-day clock will start for you to get your account in order. In the, main, in the meantime, beloved community, we need you to continue to watching videos and stay tuned for the new and improved video look 2.0 kind regards corporate executives and community leaders now the first thing that i want to say really quickly is when we start seeing seeing platform 2.0s and stuff like that historically it's not a good sign however the reason why i feel different because uh, about this and its 2.0 and its rebuild and its revamp is because of who's behind it now a lot of people that may not like sam lee for whatever reason or whatever the hyperverse journey um, but if we're being honest for those of us that got or for those of you i wasn't in it very long uh, but for those of you that were in it long enough to make a profit you understand that it was around for a long time and this space like i said like i say all the time uh, none of us have a crystal ball we don't know how long these platforms are going to last they can be here today and gone tomorrow that is the reality of this space now whoever hasn't accepted that reality i don't know what else to tell you but um, as it pertains to this, I'm actually optimistic about what's going on. Um, they said it would be flipped on between the next 12 and 24 hours. Well, I actually believe that in the Telegram group that I am um, looking in, there was a post that said uh, that I believe it's getting ready to get rolling. Now, I want to go ahead and jump into the uh, Telegram group now. Or it should already, it might even already be rolling. So this is the 23rd. Um, this is an announcement on disabled accounts. All right. This was yesterday. They posted this around 1 13 a.m. And I'm not sure if I got a chance to read this or not, but it's good to just read it again. It says disabled account announcement. Another progressive meeting with the community leaders and corporate executives. As was noted in the previous announcement, over 10,000 accounts were disabled due to suspicious activity. The initial step to rectify the situation is to re-enable all accounts and allow time to correct all violations. If you have a disabled account, you will have 14 days to correct all violations. If you are found to still have violations after 14 days, or if you have violations in the future, you will be permanently banned from utilizing the VidiLook platform. To ensure that you meet all the requirements for, for VidiLook, please consider the following. Only one account per person. I repeat. Only one account per person. Number two, only one withdrawal wallet address per account. Very important. Only one withdrawal wallet address per account. And number three, video ad watching should be on one device per account. Any exceptions may be subject to KYC. All right. And of course, I don't have a problem with KYC, but they're just saying, hey, you might be subject to it if you uh, have any exceptions to these. The 14-day countdown will start on April the 23rd, 2023, and will end 
on May 6th, 2023 at 11.59 p.m. Eastern USA. All rules will be strictly enforced. Time regards corporate and community leaders. Now, that was that. And I believe there's one, there was another announcement um, that I saw. Did I post it in my group? Okay, so there was a leader, all right, um, from Tammy and the executive leaders, all right? This was forwarded from another group. And this says, uh, Vidilip Recovery Progress Report. I posted this in my group around 9 o'clock a.m. Um, corporate executives and community leaders are working very hard. I think I already... I think I already read that one. I already read that. Let me see if there's, ah, there's another one here. Um, it says, based on 1045, 1044 a.m., I think we already read this, um, all accounts should now be unlocked. Um, and then, of course, it was a personal request for people that have been reaching out to her personally to stop. All right. So um, don't. Uh, I don't have a issue with any of that at all. Uh, anyway, this is video look. Oh, so one of the other things that I wanted to do is because, of course, we can still watch ads, that means we should be able to still earn in VDL, right? And if we're still able to earn in VDL, the hope is that we are still able to turn that VDL into USDT and move forward with a withdrawal. Now, that's what I would like to do. I would like to move forward with a withdrawal in USDT. I have quite a bit of USDT in here, and I'm hoping they will allow me to do so I'm going to have 4,200 USDT just sitting here. Now, the first thing I want to check real quick is check my subscriptions, all my subscriptions. Um, I think they are, oh, I think I even read no new members for the next 14 days or something like that. So um, I'll double back in a second to see if I can find that note as well. I think that was in the video. For those of you that saw the video that I shared into my Telegram group, I think it said that on there. Um, but let's see, let's go ahead and do a withdrawal here. All right. Ooh, excuse me. All right, let me get my codes together. All right, here we go. All right, let's see if they'll let us process a withdrawal. All right. Now, it says successful withdrawal. Of course, it's going to go into a, um, show you what it looks like. Withdrawal records, processing, right? So, let's say processing. The last withdrawal that I did that was completed was on the 19th. So, it's been a couple, it's been a few days um, since we've had a chance to do a withdrawal, but uh, we're looking forward to see that process, see if it works, if we're able to get withdrawals now this Monday. Uh, and, of course, we'll check back in later uh, to see if that has come through for us. With that being said, uh, Video Look is going through a lot of different changes. We're looking forward to getting more details on the changes. The biggest thing is to comply with whatever they're saying. If if you want to be a part of Video Look, if you don't want your account blocked, make sure you comply with the three things that we talked about. And um, we're hoping for the best. With that being said, put your 2FA on all the platforms that will allow you and all your wallets because crypto is indeed the wild, wild west, y'all. If you ain't strapped, you're bound to get hacked. All right, ask me how I know. It's not very fun at all. If you like this content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. If you want to be updated and notified about everything going on here at BOJ, just make sure you hit the notification bell as well. And please, sir, please, ma'am, don't get scammed by the WhatsApp man. All right, WhatsApp man, get you. There's nothing I can do to help you. With that being said, I'll see y'all on the next one. This is Vidi Look. Peace out.